Luna the Moon. This is one of the great bedtime stories for girls. Long, long ago, there was a little girl named Luna. Luna lived in an attic far from the village. She liked sitting on the rooftop and watching the beautiful night sky. One day, Luna wanted to touch the sky. So, she reached up high into the sky. Ha! Huh, what is this? She thought to herself. She touched that and it lit up. And so, Luna started to draw things in the sky. At first, a snowman, then a gigantic house, a chubby big belly bear, pretty flowers and fluttering butterflies. Image source greater than www. 123RF. Come. Oh no, I have run out of space, she wondered. As Luna sat back and gazed at her drawings in the night sky, she suddenly realized that she had drawn her brilliant figures on something that was round and bright. I wonder that that round and bright thing is. I better wipe of drawings, she thought. So, Luna got a mop with a long stick and up, down, left, right, she started erasing her finger drawings. Wow, that's amazing, Luna cried. In the clear night sky, Luna saw a big, bright, round pancake glowing in the sky. Luna was so mesmerized that she couldn't take her eyes off of it. Wow, it's so beautiful, I'm going to ask the villagers if they know what that is, she thought. Luna rushed down and was off to the village. However, while Luna was on her way, the bright, round pancake in the sky started to disappear, little by little. And Luna had no idea what was going on up in the sky. As soon as Luna arrived in the village, she went door to door to get answers from the people. Please, come out and take a look what's in the night sky, she cried. Ha! Huh, are you talking about that thing that looks like a boat? asked one of the villagers. Ha! Huh, just a minute ago. It was a gigantic round thing that looked low-key a pancake. Let me go and mop the sky again. When you see the big, bright, round thing, please make sure to look at it carefully. Then, let me know what it is, said Luna. Luna quickly started to run home. But on her way, the bright boat in the sky started to disappear. Little by little. When Luna arrived home, she climbed up to the rooftop. Then, she took the same mop with a long stick and again, up and down, left and right, she moved. With each stroke of the mop, the bright thing became bigger and bigger just like the pancake, it was like before. Then, finally, they saw the bright, round thing about which Luna was talking about. There it is. It is the first time I have seen that. What should we call it? cried the villagers. Well, Luna discovered it. Why don't we name it Luna? suggested one of the ladies. The people in the village were captivated by the bright moon in the dark sky. And since then, they call the big, bright, Round thing Luna, the moon. Here is a visual depiction of one of the best bedtime stories for girls Luna the Moon. Bedtime Stories for Girls video.